the energy secretary says about the cost of Americans heating their homes in the winter it will be more expensive this year than last year. So why is the administration now <coughs> considering shutting down the Line 5 pipeline from Canada to Michigan? So, Peter, uh, that is inaccurate. That is not that is not right. Uh, so any reporting indicating that some decision has been made, again, is not accurate. Uh, but what I will say is I'll lay this out for you for a little bit here. Where we are at, we, where we are is with this is that the Canada has decided to invoke the dispute resolution provisions of the 1977 Transit Pipelines Treaty. We expect that both the U.S. and Canada will engage constructively in those negotiations in addition to being one of the closest as allies, Canada remains a key U.S. partner in energy trade as well as efforts to address climate change and protect the environment. It, I, I will also add this too, is that the current, the current Line 5, 5 pipeline is subject to litigation between Enbridge and the state of Michigan. So again, I would, it is inaccurate what you just stated. What's but so but the, the reporting, the reporting about uh, us wanting to shut down the Line launching. 5. I said, uh, is, it, is it being studied right now? Is the administration studying the impact? Of shutting down yeah. the line five. Yes, so, we are. We are. So that. What's inaccurate? Well, I thought you were saying that we were going to shut it down, yeah. but that is that is not inaccurate. Be, okay, great, 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 great. But I'll, the Army Corps of Engineers is preparing an environmental impact to look through this. Okay, and yeah. then I, now that the president is on the record uh, as of Saturday supporting compensation for illegal immigrants who are separated from family at the border, who? counts as separated. If somebody was just separated for a few hours or a few days, would they be eligible to settle a suit and get this payment from DOJ? So Peter, I will direct you to the Department of Justice for any specifics on that. We have, we have, you've asked us this question, we have answered it, and I will refer you to the Department of Justice on any specifics. Great detail though about the policy, so if he can answer it, I just, uh, I'm curious, uh, going back to 2018, some illegal immigrants were given a choice get deported alone or get deported with their kids. If somebody chose to be separated, chose to go back by themselves without their family, would they be eligible to settle one of these lawsuits? Peter, I'm going to refer you to Department of Justice. I don't have anything more to say, and I'm going to move on, okay? okay. All right, thank you.